Uh, so welcome guy back to our tutorial and now we have our character here and what we are going to do is now we are going now to try to change the text here. and this one I'm going to go to the Google and I like to look like um, man um, growth Uh, texture so it can go to the image and I see what I have whether there's something that I like hmm so this one is sometimes a challenging thing to do like you need to have like Good. So I'll just show you with an example. Let me just take this one. I just need to come and save this photo there. And I can also save like this one here. So uh, if guys you hear like this, a problem with my microphone is sometime when I'm talking, I'm falling. So I just save this one there. okay now let me just go back and what i'm going to do is that um i'm going to select my shot and i click here i open this one and then i cut the image whatever i downloaded and just say that i import so now you can see my shot is already changed so i can just try to play with the brightness oh this one here I can also try to pray with the to pray with the colors. You can pray with the colors and try to make it more unique, not the way like the contrast. Okay. And this one, let's see what we get. We are green, so let's let's leave it the way it was. So uh, you can try to pray. So that's why I'd like to share. So if you just want to share the texture of the trouser, you can come back here and say, um, you can like jeans, that's a jeans. Then you just say such. Uh, textile. Let's see whether you have like this one look a bit good. Let me just save this one here. And just come now I select my jeans. And I want to change the color of the jeans. And then I can just try to play with the brightness. contrast whatever we are doing here is not it doesn't have to be so perfect like saturation no let's play with it yeah it's look a bit better let's leave it like that way so now we have have our own character we have shaped the hem here we have changed the clothes, we have the teeth and the eyes, we have done everything. And now our character is ready to go to the uh, icon. So whatever I'm, I'm just going to do is that on this video, I'm just going to export this character to the icon. So I just go to the export. So you can do, do this, you can just come here. Now here, and say you want to set it direct to the icon, you can go to the files. You go to the export and then set it to the icon. Those are the th two things that you can do. So I'll just like click here and I say I want to set this character to the icon. So this one it will just show me that it's loading. And now we can have our character on the icon. I want to see how it will look like.
so this is our character here so let me click j and you see the hair look a bit yeah but it demash everything so for me i'll just like to i'm not going to do anything on this here i'll just leave it the same way it is so guys what you are going to do now is that we are going to now on the next video try to do some for modification and try to add some motions and now I, I can show you how now to set this character to the um the uh, unreal engine and now we start now working with the unreal engine and try to make our first cinematic movie using this character we made and i thank those guys who have been subscribing to my channel and thank you for your support and if you have any other question you can just write on the comments and i'll try as as much as i can to answer your question and sometimes for me it's not so easy to do some tutorial for some one or two things but uh yeah i'll try what i can to see that uh the thing that this character looks so let me just put this character to the high I have, I have realized something because when you put it to the custom the face of the character doesn't look much better like now you see this character has now the skin tone is looking better so um and the hair fit seems so good like this is the hair we made from the z brush just a simple hair to show you how you are going to do it so um just a small review uh we have done our character made our character everything from the zero try to use the skin gen and everything then we use the z brush a bit to make our hair here this is the hair that we made can zoom it a bit and then we exported this hair back to the color creator and then we did some cloth texture and now we have our character on the eye clone and i'm so happy for you watching this video hope to see you soon okay bye